watch it later, right? Yeah. All right. Um, if I have this figure, and I'm going from A to B, first of all, let's get the easy out of the way, Alex. Let's determine, am I enlarging it from A to B, or am I reducing from A to B? And Alex says? Reducing, right? It's a reduction. So remember, if it's a reduction, then our k has to be less than 1, right? k is our scale factor. How much are we reducing it? Are we reducing it by 1 half? Are we reducing it by 1 third? By 1 fourth? By 1 hundredth? How, what is the factor that we reduce each side? So to figure that out, we need to create a ratio. So let's figure out what is the length of a, all right? So a is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. b. What is the length of B? Two. Okay. So therefore, since I'm going from one to another, I need to know this to be less than one. Kevin, what I'm going to have is I want to go A to B, which is going to be six to two. However, in rational form to find my portion, I'm going to write it as two over six, which is equal to one third, which is less than one. So the scale factor for my a to my b is going to be 1 third the size, OK? 1 third the size. Photo. Photo. 